Hey everybody, this is Brandon from betteratEverything.info. In today's video, I'm going to go over how to use the sweep command in AutoCAD's 3D modeling workspace. Uh, to switch over to 3D modeling, you're going to simply click on the gear in the bottom right corner, and it's going to bring up a menu. You can just select 3D modeling. Uh, once you're here, I'm in the top view. Uh, you can draw in whatever view you, you find uh, easiest. And so far, I've dr drawn uh, the outline of what's going to be, uh, I'm going to call it a bumper. It'll be a tubed bumper for a truck or a off-road vehicle of some sort. Uh, it doesn't really matter. This is just an example to show you sweep. So once you've got the outline of your uh, object, this is called the path. I'm going to draw the closed polygon or object that I'm going to sweep along that path. You can do them in either order. Um, I like to do it this way. Uh, I just switched to the front view, so I'm looking directly into my object that I drew earlier, the path. I'm going to type in UCS, and this is to change the uh, origin of my uh, work plane. I'm going to type in view or V after typing in UCS and hitting enter. I type in V and hit enter, and then it orients it so that the XY is in the view that I'm working in. Uh, next, I'm going to hit C for circle and hit enter, and I'm going to draw a circle, roughly the diameter of the tube or pipe or whatever I want to use, and it's going to do a circle there. Now, if you go back up a view, there we go. Um, now you can see at a bit of an isometric view what it looks like. So we've got the path, which is this long line, and we've got the object you're going to sweep along the path. And it's pretty much just going to extrude it along that, that, uh, that path. So we're going to use the sweep command by typing in sweep or clicking it up along the top here. First, you're going to select the object you want to sweep along the path. Now this can be an open or a closed polyline or polygon. I'm going to choose my circle, and it's going to ask if I have any more at the bottom. I don't, so I'm going to hit enter. And now it asks to select the path that I want to sweep my object along. And to do that, I'm going to select my bumper outline. And there you have it. That's the sweep command in uh, about 30 seconds. It's pretty easy. And you can see that my bumper is kind of cool. You could get a little more creative and uh, obviously and add more to your paths or your objects that you're sweeping but it's a very useful command and i hope you enjoy the video thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe to my page and check out the blog better at everything.info cheers